Ukraine stands strong, a nation forged through resilience and unity. Its armed forces are well-trained, disciplined, and fiercely determined. Every soldier fights not just with weapons, but with heart, purpose, and conviction. In every battle, they give everything for their land, their people, and their future. In the Donetsk region, on a short stretch of road, Ukrainian drone operators from the 30th Separate Mechanized Brigade carried out a series of precise and devastating strikes. Using fiber optic drones, they destroyed a Russian ATV along with its driver, set a Soviet-style van known as a loaf on fire, and eliminated a motorcyclist, and finished off another soldier with a shotgun. The footage shows one of the so-called Russian drone hunters, armed with a shotgun in feigning bravado, diving sharply, trying to either escape or shoot down the drone. But within seconds, it is already lying motionless on the road. Precision, speed, and control. Ukrainian forces are demonstrating once again that no target is safe. Don't forget to support the channel with a like and a comment. It means a lot to us and helps us keep going. Your support makes a difference, more than you know. A Russian Mavic drone never even made it off the ground. Our FPV got there first. Target locked, position wiped out. The hunt for Russian drone operators continues. In this footage, a soldier sets up his drone near a crumbling, abandoned building. Just as he's about to launch, a Ukrainian FPV drone spots him and strikes with pinpoint precision. They are doing their best for Ukraine's victory. Who is for Ukraine's victory? Write, slave Ukraine in the comments. Ukrainian aviation struck Russian positions in Glushkovo, Kursk region, using a powerful GBU-62 bomb. The impact was devastating. Buildings shattered, fire and smoke rising into the sky. Precision from the air, deep behind enemy lines. In Oleshki, Kherson Oblast, Ukrainian forces attacked a concentration of Russian troops. The footage shows Russian soldiers moving between buildings, trying to find cover, but there is no escape. First, one group is destroyed by a precise strike. A few moments later, another group of four people trying to regroup comes under fire. The occupiers are destroyed one after another. No cover, no safe zone. A drone flies straight toward a Russian soldier in open terrain and strikes with deadly precision, exploding the entire area. Seconds later, more drones follow. Russian troops hiding under trees, behind bushes, or out in the open. None are spared. One by one, small infantry groups are wiped out before they can regroup. By destroying these mobile units, we prevent the soldier from building momentum, cutting off their ability to launch further offensives. This is how modern warfare works. No mass assault, no trenches, just precise strikes, surgical hits, and total control of the battlefield. Ukraine I Ukrainian drones continue their precision work in the Kupians direction. In this video, we see how aerial reconnaissance detects Russian soldiers hiding under bushes, behind trees, or in shallow trenches. They try to remain unnoticed lying motionless, blending into the terrain. But high-resolution thermal images give away their presence. Every movement, every shape is analyzed. A few seconds later, the drone locks onto a target, dives and hits the target right in the body. The explosion hits not one target, but its entire position. Debris, fire and dust fill the screen. Open fields offer no protection. Trees become traps. Russian soldiers are seen trying to hide in different places in the forested area. They run, desperately trying to find cover, but the drone follows them silently. One by one, they are shot down. The accuracy of the shooting is terrifying. Dozens of Russian soldiers have been killed in the past few days. The Borovaya Brigade, known for its coordination and precision, continues to undermine the operational capabilities of the supposed side. It's not just about killing personnel, 
It's about destroying logistics, destroying supplies, and blocking movement. Scattered across the landscape are burnout vehicles like motorcycles and trucks. Some are still smoking, their metal frames twisted and blackened. In several cases, secondary explosions indicate ammunition inside. It's obvious, no convoy goes unnoticed. No place is truly safe. Command posts, shelters, and supply points are all under fire. Drones circle, wait, and strike when the moment is perfect. Don't forget to support the channel with a like and a comment. It means a lot to us and helps us keep going. Your support makes a difference, more than you know. Artillery joins in with devastating precision, finishing what the drones started. The Russian forces are running out of options. Communications are down. They operate in smaller groups now, more carefully, trying to avoid detection. But the eyes in the sky are relentless. Every heat signature, every radio signal, every movement in the bushes, they are all signs, and everything is being watched. This is not random chaos. This is a calculated strategy, a slow and methodical reduction in presence, numbers, and morale. As the days go by, control shifts. One field, one road, one tree line at a time, cleared, secured, and held. Cleared. Ukrainian drones, both FPV and bombers, do not give Russian soldiers a moment's peace. They glide silently over the forest canopy, tracking every shadow, every movement under the trees. In this forest, silence means danger. Drones do not search randomly, they hunt. We see Russian soldiers hiding, hoping that the forest will hide them. But the drone's thermal optics cut through the branches. One by one, the soldiers are detected. Some do not notice the enemy approaching. Others, just before the impact, manage to look up and see the drone diving towards them. And then, well, impact, flash, rumble. The forest shakes, scattered leaves catch fire. The earth flies into the air. What was once a hidden position turns into a crater. The few who try to crawl away are tracked and destroyed in seconds. The Ukrainian operators control these drones with calm precision. Each mission is carefully calculated. Distance, angle, time. Targets are chosen, routes are plotted, and the result is almost always final. No panic, no rush, just quiet, systematic destruction. The camera briefly shows scattered equipment, motionless silhouettes, and smoldering earth. Russian soldiers often don't have time to react. They might hear a buzzing sound or catch a glimpse of a drone, but nothing more. In some clips, the drone follows the target for almost a minute, waiting for the right moment. The strike is carried out with surgical precision. No casualties, no hesitation. This is the reality of these forests. Ukrainian soldiers don't need to enter the forest to take control of the situation. The sky is theirs. Every movement below is watched. Every cover becomes a trap. What we see here is not chaos. This is a controlled, deliberate, and highly effective process. One by one, the positions are cleared, and the message is simple. Hiding won't help. They will be found. Elsewhere, small groups try to change positions in the forest, hoping to regroup. But the sound of an approaching drone with onboard video surveillance causes instant fear. They run, sometimes into the forest, sometimes into the open. But running does not save them. The drones adjust their course in the air, accelerating. Hits are direct. A single precise drop from a Ukrainian specialist hits its mark. The bomb falls silently from above. The camera tracks it all the way down. It lands directly on one Russian soldier in an open field. The explosion is instant and brutal. The blast wave spreads outward, throwing dust, dirt, 
and fragments in every direction. Four others nearby are caught in the shockwave. They try to move, but the impact reaches them too. No shelter, no time. One strike, five soldiers affected. The Buryavoy Brigade continues to deliver precise and powerful strikes. In this footage, we see Ukrainian drones identifying Russian transport hidden in a narrow ravine, trucks, tanks, and soldiers resting nearby. Don't forget to support the channel with a like and a comment. It means a lot to us and helps us keep going. Your support makes a difference, more than you know. Every vehicle is marked, every movement is recorded. A few moments later, the strikes begin. A wave of explosions rolls across the area. Armored vehicles burn, shelters collapse. High-precision weapons and artillery finish off what the drones detect. Dozens of killed and wounded are destroyed. This is Kupyansk, a vital direction.